I don't know if you can see it, but horizontal lens just beside me. Look at this. Isn't that awesome? I had some different plans for this video here. I was going out to look for the red deer a couple of days ago. I was out and I had high hopes for a deer coming out and yeah, no deer at all. Not a single animal to, to see that day there. So yeah, I figured out I'm going to try uh, one more time with the shorebirds and uh, maybe they're a little bit larger flocks of maybe dunlins or sand plovers or little stints and yeah so the goal is to go out there going out with my friend uh, Trulls and uh, hopefully we're gonna have a great time photographing shorebirds so yeah but um, I have some sad news though I was uh, planning out to go to Finland to photograph w bears, wolves and wolverines uh, now in a two weeks time but unfortunately because of the coronavirus everything has closed down and I'm, oh, I'm so sad not going out there. Uh, the rumors said there are uh, the wolves are getting a lot of babies lately and they come really close so I have really looked forward to to go back there and uh, photograph those beautiful animals but yeah like everything else this year here is not a year of uh, planning out things because you can get turned upside down because of this coronavirus which i'm really fed up with but yeah i cannot do anything about it so instead of that i have to figure out a new plan uh, i have some thoughts i'm not going to share it with you right now but uh, follow along and uh, I will share with you when the time comes. But now it's time for some shorebird photography, so let's go. I don't know if you can hear me in the wind here, but hopefully you can. I'm back here and I'm not using the, the, the pop-up blind, but I'm using this camouflage blanket here. Okay. It is quite windy here, but so I hope you can hear me. This is really, really nice. I'm actually using my D4S with the 1.4 converter. Uh, there's something wrong with my charger for the D500 so I'm actually going to use the D4S I have a couple of comments tell me that why I'm not using the D4S so yeah I'm going to do that now but this is really cool a lot more birds now than I was a couple of weeks ago so that's good dunlins and plovers and all kinds of small birds but here is some tunnel lens just beside me look at this <gasps> isn't that awesome oh. did you hear that that was a tunnel lens flying past me really cool bird See if you can go photograph them. Hang on.
had the plover. I think it was two and a half to three meters from me. So, so close. I almost thought it was going to go up on top of my, my camouflage hair. But ah, it was so nice and it was adult as well. They are so beautiful. I can see some plovers around here. Hopefully I get that experience once again. It was nice. Oh. so hard to vlog here and I think that wind is a big challenge for the sound so I'm just going to leave leave everything here uh, I'm going to tell you a little bit my setting I have the 1.4 converter so I'm at f5.6 and I'm around ISO 1000 just to get a little bit shutter speed it's not full sun uh, the sun is almost breaking through the clouds but I want a little bit uh, I, want, uh, I want the shutter speed so I can free, the, free some action in case they do some wing flaps and yeah whatever but yeah now I'm just going to lay here put my cal camouflage over me and just enjoy this beautiful scenery here Some everything can happen. Suddenly they come closer. 